This is class 9, unit 4, prose, 70 oranges. The story 17 oranges was written by the author Bill Nocton. He was a famous playwright and author. He was best known for his work Alfie. In the story 17 oranges, the narrator was working in dogs. Let us see about the narrator. The narrator was a teenager. He loved oranges. He could eat oranges all day and every day. He was working for the Swift Delivery Company and often went in and out of the docks. In fact, he was not a thief. He took things only when he found them. Yet, it was his habit to steal something whenever he left the docks, hidden upon his apron. It was a big apron. Next, we are going to see about Clem Jones. Clem Jones was one of his friend who was also working in docks. He was one of the careful planner in theft. One day, Clem Jones was carrying one box which had one cat. While he was carrying Pongo, the policeman stopped him and made him to open the box. When he opened the box, the cat ran to the ship. Clem Jones was chasing the cat, but he was not able to catch it. He became very sad and returned home. But when he reached, he was very happy. Why? Because he stole a big piece of Dutch cheese. Like that, our narrator was also taken few oranges from dogs and he hidden it in his apron. While he was coming, he was catched by the policeman. He was taken to the police cabin and Pongo placed the 17 oranges which were taken as evidence against narrator. Pongo asked many questions about the orange which he taken for from the dogs. But he didn't give any response to him. He believed that the best plan was to say nothing. So Pongo became very angry and decided to call another policeman for evidence. The narrator was very much worried. He looked at the walls, at the door, at the 17 oranges and at the apron with its broken string. The narrator had to do something immediately to save his job and himself from being sent to the jail. He heard his mind asking him to eat all the oranges up with their pips and peels. With their pips and peels. The narrator started to eat those oranges with pip and peel. When Pongo came with another policeman, there was no oranges on the table. But there was only the smell of orange. The policeman became angry, but there was no real evidence for theft. So they decided to leave narrator. For a week, the narrator was running to the toilet all the time. That was a bitter experience for him. Well, thereafter he was never crazy about oranges. Okay, let us see the moral of the story. What is the moral of the story? Never be obsessed with things you like the most. Hope you have understood the story. Thank you.